Mike suffered a stroke four years ago. He received traditional therapy post-stroke and participated in our independent gym program after he was discharged from therapy. Compensatory patterns in Mike is he hikes his hip up and he circumducts it in order to have foot clearance. His right shoulder is always elevated and he's really putting a lot of his efforts into the right side, more of like an avoidance pattern of the left side. To be on bionic leg came into my mind because it's a patient activated device in which he gets the auditory feedback to let him know whether or not he's performing the gait pattern correctly. Using the tibia on bionic leg, we worked on sit to stands and getting Michael to shift his weight more towards the left and use the left leg more to get him from standing to sitting position. We worked on stairs with the goal of him being able to go up and down reciprocally using one railing. We're able to do up to six flights of stairs um, without rest. He can go down the stairs reciprocally, which normally he cannot. And we worked on wall slides to just improve his knee flexion and as a strengthening tool. We're in the early stages. This was Mike's second time using the Tibion Bionic Leg, but have seen immediate carryover with both sessions. The carryover after using the Tibion Bionic Leg today, we saw improved knee flexion, which gave him better foot clearance and a safer walking pattern. And he was able to descend stairs reciprocally, which normally he cannot. I believe that if I work at it and have hope and determination that this bionic leg will help me, I sincerely believe that I will be walking normally in no time.